Well, this October, there are more events than ever before for animal lovers to get out and enjoy and maybe even find a new best friend in the making as well. Good time for that. The yeah. next few weeks, so you will have your pick of Halloween-themed events, helping to support animals in need. Uh, joined now by the Executive Director of the Humane Society of West Michigan, uh, Tanya Jaskowski. Uh, and we want to know who we've got here, this handsome uh, <laughs> guy that you've got with you. Yes, so I brought Bro Boss with me today. He's about a six-year-old um, mixed breed that we have available for adoption right now. Um, just an absolute love of a dog. Yes. He loves give, getting attention. Um, he's the most excited to get in the car of any dog <laughs> I think I've ever brought here before. Right. Yeah. Hey, he's um, excited for his, his close-up. His tail just doesn't stop wagging. That's so so. <laughs> Amazing. So yeah, so obviously he's got a lot of energy, a lot of fun. He wants to make friends. What, yeah. What's a good family for him, would yeah. you say? Um, so we do have a history of him living with dogs before, so we okay. think he could be successful living with another dog. Um, unfortunately, we don't have a history of him with cats or kids, okay. um, but we think he would do well in a variety of homes. Okay, and Boss looks like he'll be the boss of the family. Whatever family uh, gives him a forever home. Why not pet you, <laughs> He's so lovable. We were kind of uh, petting him and giving him some rubs during the break. Uh, and if it's not Boss, we know there are a lot of other animals out there mm -hmm. to help. Tell us about uh, some of the events this fall. Yeah, so um, <laughs> this Saturday um, we have one of our really fun events called Bark in the Dark. Um, we're going to be down at Riverside Park this weekend with um, some live music, beer tent, food trucks, um, mm -hmm. a very popular doggy costume contest um, that people love every year, um, and a cornhole tournament. So it's going to be a really fun event. We would love for people to come down to Riverside Park and spend their Saturday evening with us. And I think our, even our own chief meteorologist, Kevin Craig, will be there yeah. as well having fun. He <laughs> loves this event. Yes. So. Hey. Let's talk about, I mean, obviously it's a fun event. You want to bring your, own, a strong boy. Yes. Bring, bring your pets out to that. But uh, I mean, this is an important fundraiser for the Humane Society. Talk about what some of that money will go to help. Yeah. Um, so all of the money that we raise at this oh. event and many of our events goes directly back into the care for our animals. So um, all of our dogs, cats, rabbits, everything that we have up for adoption, um, a lot of care goes into and getting tail. them ready for adoption <laughs> and a lot of medical and behavioral care. So it sure. goes right back into them. And if, uh, if Boss is your guy, if you see this face and you're like, I want to add him to my family, how can people learn more? Um, they can go on our website, hswestmi.org, okay. um, and view him or any of the animals that we have available for adoption. Okay. Amazing. I think he wants to help Kevin do weather. <laughs> He's looking over at Kevin. I don't know. We want some more pets over yeah. here, some more rubs over here. So, okay, we'll, we'll send that on over to Kevin to handle the weather. <laughs>